Hi guys, welcome back in the Angular JS Builder tutorial. And in this video, we are just going to start with the Angular 7. And specifically in this video, we are focusing on uh, how we can just getting start with the Angular. So how we can uh, install the things that that needs for the Angular like Node.js, npm, and Angular CLI. And after that, we will make the first change and uh, learn how we can start with the Angular. All right. So now let's get started. So first of all, uh, when we are installing the Angular, we need some more things like we need to uh, Node.js, we need npm, and we need Angular CLI to use the uh, command line in, with the Angular. And the CLI with the Angular is the best way to use the Angular. Okay, so just open the command prompt, and just first of all, you have to just write there a node minus v. And you will see that uh, in my case the old node is already installed maybe in your case node is not installed for that you just have to write sudo apt install node js minus g all right okay so you have to just use the node okay so with that command you will see that the node is getting installed okay so i am just going to stop this command because it will take lots of time and i already have the node installed to save the time i'm just going to break this okay and when this command is successfully run you will see that uh, you have to just uh, use uh, node minus v and you will see that uh, node installed in your system after that you must have the npm okay so for that uh, why the npm we will talk with the installing time so that we can save the time uh, just right here sudo npm install npm minus z okay so we need the npm package for to manage the uh, packages of the angular like when you are uh, uh, installing the package for Google Maps and Google APIs and much more things like the graphs and all these things like sometimes you install with the uh, like validations also like some things okay so that time you need the another package to handle them in a uh, one way you can use the npm the full form of the npm is the node package manager i also have this already installed my system that's why i'm going to break this command and when you are uh, uh, successfully run this command then you will see that uh, with the uh, npm minus v you are able to see the npm version also okay and after the installing of them uh, now you have to uh, just come over the angle so just write here npm install minus z at the rate angular uh, slash li cli okay this command will install the angular cli in your system okay so now you can see that it's just installing this okay so for the moment i'm going to pause this video so that uh, the video will be the short and watchable too okay so whenever it's just installed i will stop the uh, i will just start the uh, video shooting again okay welcome back now you see that uh, the angular cli is installed okay sometime uh, you have to put uh, the sudo with the angular cli and sometime it's work with the default and if is if this is showing uh, that uh, there is an error of the uh, authentication then or permission then you have to use a sudo all right after that just clear everything now just you have to go where you want to uh, store your uh, angular code like I just want to go on a dashboard desktop and now uh, okay and after the dash dashboard just write here ng this command is generating the angular code okay ng new my youtube okay and just hit the enter 
and it will ask that you would to uh, you would to like the angular uh, routing then you can write the yes and if you don't use don't want to use then you can skip it also okay now it will take some time also okay so with that time uh, just see that is folder is generated or not yet now when you when you are just seeing that you already have a folder on the desktop with the my youtube just open in the command prompt also so just open the new right here cd my youtube and just write here code dot and it will open your command inside the visual studio visual code okay so here you will see that you have the source folder with the app assets and everything and still it's uh, installing i think so why still it's installing because with the angular you need lots of npm packages and you will see that the npm packages are just going to install here okay and just after that we are able to use this app okay uh, still they are installing we will we can check the angular folder and after that we will i'll show you that where you exactly first need to first change and how you can uh, uh, <clears throat> see it in the browser also so let's see there is an app folder which is the main in, inside the src folder and uh, in the app you have to write the routings and the uh, html folder css folder and everything like the, and uh, app dot module also okay and there is a style file also uh, we just go to the assets and here you can write your public files like style images and everything and there is a style dot css default file this is a test default file so, okay so these are the important file also so these this is the package dot json file uh, you will see that the every package every dependency will be mentioned here and it's still taking some time okay so i'm going to pause again i think because it can be take some two to three minutes more all right so here you can see that we just uh, install the angular cli and now just uh, you uh, after the angular cli and angular also now just you can uh, write here cd my YouTube okay and here just you can write here uh, ng serve minus minus open and here you just uh, see that the build is just going to start with that on the port of on 4200 because this is the angular by default port and after if you just open uh, with add the minus open open it will automatically open in the browser and here you can you can see that welcome in the uh, my youtube which is my application name and here you can see that some more stuff so now here you can find this in your application so for that you just have to the go in the app dot component dot html here you can see the welcome to and your application name will be comes in the app dot uh, component so here you can just uh, write here whatever you want to write like like my video okay and just uh, remove this one also and now you will see that it will uh, build is start uh, again sometime automatically just you can uh, writer ng serve and if you use the sudo then it will automatically refresh sometime it's not automatically refresh but uh, uh, in the next video i'll tell you that how we can do that if this is not doing automatically all right so here you can see that like my video okay so in the next video we will learn more things about the angler so don't forget to subscribe our channel so thanks guys thanks for watching this video